Good morning. It's like 7 a.m. No, it's 6. 6.20. It's 6.20 a.m. We're awake. We're going to Starbucks in our cute outfits. Let's do it. Just walking down from our hotel to Starbucks and it's just so cute. And it's gonna be like so quiet. Yeah. Nobody's awake yet. <laughs> it's so calm. It's so calm. And there's the Starbucks right there. Beautiful. But we both actually slept pretty well, yeah. I would say. I mean, we're both on our period, full disclosure. So we both get it pretty rough. Yeah. But this is day three for me now. So I'm gonna be like doing pretty good today. This is day two for Alexa. So eh, <laughs> it'll be touch and go. Yeah. But I think she'll be okay. And it's just gorgeous. Like the sun hasn't even come up over the hill over there yet. Ah! There's the ocean. And there's where all the rich people live. Yeah. Could you imagine working at this Starbucks and just having this beer view on the daily? That would be wild. So I think we are going to get our coffee. I got a lemon loaf, because why not? And then we're gonna take it to the beach and eat it. So cute. Cheers. <laughs> now we're taking our coffees. I'm going for a beach walk and actually the sand is so cold. It's like 50 something degrees out, but the sun is coming out and it said that it was gonna be cloudy all day and that doesn't look very cloudy to me. I mean, there's definitely clouds, but like there's blue skies. So we're both pretty happy about it. We're gonna walk over to this little like cove looking area. We'll see. We're just exploring and it's just so freaking pretty. Like it's like a little cove. Gorgeous. And then I mean not to mention this. Hello. What a morning. All right, we've gotten ourselves slightly more ready, slightly more put together, put some pigtails in. We've both, you know, taken care of our duties, our, our menstrual duties and also duties and we're gonna go on a hike. I feel like I am doing the same, unintentionally, the same thing every time I come here. But this hike is just so beautiful. It's not really about the hike, it's more about like the view mm -hmm. and just the drive up there and stuff. So we're gonna do that, maybe get some smoothie bowls and just have a nice lovely morning together. So I didn't bring hiking attire. I was this close and then I was like, well, we didn't really talk about it, so I'm not going to. But Alexa brought her hiking attire, I did not, so. Here's what I'm wearing. I'm making do and I'm literally just gonna wear the sports bra that I wore to sleep last night. The leggings that are definitely not for hiking, but you know, whatever. And then my Converse. Uh, they're white. I hope they don't get too dirty, but I can always clean them. So let's go. For those of you LB fans out here, here's the high school. Did they ever even really go to high school? I don't think they ever showed it at the high school, no. They, they but here's what they're up. freaking rich high school looks like. There's also that, that's the pool over there. You guys have no idea how bad I wanted to go to school here because Laguna Beach came out when I was in high school mm -hmm. and I wanted to go here so freaking bad. They're also like definitely in school today so I probably shouldn't be oh. like filming. <laughs> hey, here's the high school everybody. But honestly, so iconic. hard to tell on video, but that's quite literally the ocean right there. It looks like it's just sky, but it's not. It's the ocean. So it's about, it's only been, you said 23 minutes? <laughs> yep, 23, sorry. We went like almost a mile, she said. And, um, you know, mile hike to get the day started isn't bad. We were kind of like contemplating keeping going but we were like are we really trying to like get the most intense workout or are we just trying to like see some pretty views chat so we took the more leisurely <laughs> option but now we're finished and i think we might go get a smoothie bowl but i have to pee first that was so pretty and just a really nice way to like get our blood pumping first thing in the morning what time is it like 8 a.m look at us incredible this view on the way 
made down the hill. Are you joking? <laughs> this place just isn't real. Oh, that house is for sale. Should I buy it? Leave it in the comments. Oh my gosh. Just like what? <laughs> what even? Not real. Let's go get a smoothie bowl and cry about the fact that we don't live here. Yeah. Also, there's a special surprise for you Laguna Beach fans out there. Cause you know, after coming here like four times, I've learned the spots cause I Google it. So we already showed you the high school, but they didn't like obviously show the high school in the show, but like everyone went to the high school. So, you know, there's that. And I'm gonna show you another little fun, fun find. Okay, if you've never watched Laguna Beach, I apologize for if this is annoying or if you've like been to Laguna a bunch of times, I apologize if this is annoying, but there are literally people who watch these vlogs who are like in different parts of the world mm -hmm. and maybe have seen Laguna Beach and are interested. So we just parked and we're going to a smoothie bowl place and this is actually an unexpected thing I was gonna show, but for those of you who watched Laguna <laughs> and remember Jason and Lauren's like first date when he drove his parents like weird little car except it was very expensive and they went to like this place called the rooftop lounge which is right here they sat like literally right up there where those umbrellas are i've actually been there a couple times it's very beautiful and so they pulled in right here at this light in case you were wondering and you can go look it up if you don't believe me <laughs> This is also another place they went on the show. I wanna say like Steven and Kristen came here one time and then also like I wanna say like Talon and Kristen or Talon and Lauren or something. Just FYI. All right, got my pitaya bowl. It looks beautiful and delicious. Alexa got an acai bowl. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> got our ocean view right here where we're sitting outside. Love and light. So happy. All right, if anybody remembers, good old surf and sport. I answered the phone surf and sport like as a joke, probably my entirety of my senior year of high school. And now it's time for both mine and Alexa's favorite place in the world, and that's Whole Foods. I've, I Whole think Foods. I've been in this Whole Foods, but it's just so tiny and cute, mm -hmm. so let's check it out. Okay, let's yeah. get some good snacks. There is no one else in the world, besides Drew maybe, who gets more excited about going into Whole Foods than Alexa, so My mother we're in our elements. Yes. Cutest little Whole Foods to ever exist. So precious. Now we are back at the hotel. We got an umbrella from the front desk. We're gonna have a nice little beach day. It's gonna be so fun. So relaxing and I'm so ready. A absolutely beautiful day. I changed into actually not exactly a bathing suit. Uh, I'm sort of wearing a bra bathing suit combination because I brought some bathing suits but they're part of a main channel video that Alexa and I are filming that we haven't filmed yet, so I kind of didn't want to spoil it. So I'm wearing basically a like a bandeau top and a bathing suit bottom because I didn't bring an extra bathing suit. It's confusing, but no one will probably be able to tell. No. Got our little spot set up, got some shade when we're ready, and we're gonna have a nice relaxing day. So um, it may seem like it's been no time to you, but it's actually been, I went back to the room for about, what, like an hour and a half? Longer than that, you left at 12.30 and I was out there until 2.15. Dang, so mm -hmm. Alexa stayed for an extra two hours almost. I had a bit of a situation. <laughs> there were some bathroom needs happening. So, I took a little break, took some Pepto-Bismol, and now we're back and we're hanging out at the pool and I just wanna like, enjoy every last moment of sun. Ah, this is the life. I just realized you haven't had sunglasses on all day. I don't, I don't. You don't need them? I don't, like, because I tan so easily, if I wear them, I will instantly get a tan line. 
I'm so lucky. <laughs> yeah, I also like can't hang as long as Alexa can in the sun because I will burn and she won't. So we've reapplied some SPF 50. You've reapplied like all day. You've been really good about the SPF. Yeah, and so we're just gonna swim in this beautiful pool and have a lovely afternoon. We were thinking we were gonna go to Fashion Island later, but it's looking like the traffic's gonna be pretty bad. So we might just like postmate something, but I just want to spend all the time on the beach as possible. <laughs> so catch us here until dark. Got the almonds, got the water, got the veggie grill on the way. We're living our best life. We're in the hot tub now, by the way. Good morning. It is now Wednesday at about like just before 11 a.m. Alexa and I have been very, very busy this morning. We filmed our main channel videos. We went down to the beach and took some photos. I'm sorry if you can hear the wind, but I mean, look at this unbelievably beautiful day. It's making it very hard to leave, but I wanted to close out this vlog because I wanted to talk about boundaries. And I like set some pretty good boundaries for myself during the last trip and this trip where if I felt like it was like taking me out of the moment, I wasn't gonna film it. And so I didn't. So I'm like working on, as we reintegrate back into life, hopefully, and as we start doing things safely, I just really want to make sure that I'm not solely focused on getting content and I'm more focused on living in the moment. And I know that sounds really weird, but it can apply to anyone in any job situation or any life situation. I think everyone is on social media at some extent if you're watching this video. And so for me, like with it being my job, this sounds kind of dumb, but I really do think that I used to entirely worry too much about like the actual content and what that was going to look like instead of just enjoying it and like taking in the view like I was walking to get coffee at like six something this morning and I was like I should be filming like it's such a beautiful morning and like I want people to see it and like I do but at the same time I want to see it like I just want to like have it exist in my mind and like have a quiet morning I didn't even bring my phone with me so yeah I don't know I, I just kind of wanted to like not apologize for not being super present I mean I think that there's plenty of content in these vlogs to like give you a glimpse of what happened but like Alexa and I were just talking in the elevator like we've just had such a lovely time like we work so well together and it was like a perfect balance of like working but also just really relaxing and like hanging out recharging our batteries a bit and just a lot of talking like so much talking we both said last night Alexa was like this is the most I've talked in a year <laughs> It's like same. But it's just like you just always have so much to catch up on and it's just so nice to be able to have friends like that. I'm really thankful for Alexa and just to be able to do this for my job. Like I realize this is a very privileged job to have where we can come to Laguna Beach to film some content. Um, so yeah, for the first time I don't feel guilty for not vlogging the entirety of my trip and just enjoying it instead. I'm gonna put my camera away. I do not feel like filming when I'm on the airplane at all. That doesn't sound appealing to me at all. I just wanna get home to my family, shower, and take a nap. But thank you so much for being here and hanging out along on this trip and just kind of going on this journey with me. You know, for those of you who like know me or have, none of you know me, but you know what I mean? Like if you've watched me for a while, then you probably know how seriously I've taken this pandemic over the last year and some change. And so like, this is still very new for me, but it feels, really really good and I wish this for everyone like I hope everyone will get the opportunity to reconnect with their friends and just like have joy so moving forward I appreciate you being with me while I figure it out like I figure out how to vlog again because you know I have vlogged at home for a year and I'm still gonna continue vlogging at home a lot I love my at-home vlogs and I hope you do too but I'm just figuring it out is basically all I'm saying so I love you all thank you for being here thank you for watching we're gonna say goodbye to Alexa and this beautiful view I can't remember if I said, but we are staying at the inn at Laguna Beach. It's relatively affordable. I shouldn't say affordable, but like for what you get and you're yeah. literally on the beach, like I think it's the most affordable of like any of the other ones we were looking at. All the Airbnbs were like $3,000 and they were ugly and this one's like pretty nice. So yeah. anyways, so nice. I'm gonna miss this one, mm. but I'm so thankful that we had this time. So anyways, love you guys. I'm gonna put my freaking camera away. We're gonna go get some Earth Cafe. And I will see you in the next vlog. Bye!